Lindsay, stay away from the Hiltons because I'm a friend of the Hiltons. Actually, I'm not really a friend of yours because one night I sashayed into uh, Chateau Marmont, sitting there with uh, Shana Mochler, who was married to Travis Barker. Yes, and we yes. love we love yes. the good Shana, and you know her talented husband. This earpiece. I'm just gonna pull it out. And <laughs> sit there and hold it in. It's better than just sticking my. You know, sorry, everybody. That's better. Okay, there we go. It's not it's good. It's fashionable. It's like fashionable. the new thing. All right, it's better than nothing. So uh, there I was sitting at the table with Shana Mochler, and Lindsay Lohan was at the next table. And I turned around to Lindsay to start talking to her, and she goes, Don't talk to me. You were with Christine Peters, who was married to John Peters, uh, you know, of, of hit and run fame. And she goes to me, You. How dare you hang out with that slut? I'm not a friend of yours anymore, Janice. You know, and furthermore, and then Shana Mochler was picking up her her cell phone. She had a mirror in it, put lipstick on it. She goes, Shana Mochler, don't take pictures of me while I'm while I'm sitting here in a row with Janice. And so Shana goes, F you, you bitch. Sorry, everybody, it slipped. You s screw you, you whore. <laughs> you screwed my husband. You know, everybody's a having sex with everybody. I didn't ever had sex with Trina's. Travis this Mokler. sounds like a fun club. How do I get involved? I know, right? <laughs> Are you personally in a relationship? Me? Yeah. No. Presently? We're taking orders right now. I've also brought to the battle cameras. Ooh, ah, scratch my back. Lower, lower. Ah, ah. <laughs> um, battle cameras. Both these women are single. I am. My boyfriend died in June. So what I'm happened? Mega I'm single. Oh, so sorry. Yeah. Oh my God. What? <laughs> sorry. What I happened? I want to give you like a flower. You're or having something. a double mastectomy next week. Oh Let's my God. You're not you don't have to. It's the same. So I'm going to be alive. Stay in. Oh God. This is so sad. This is bad news. What happened? What did he die of? He drowned. What? Who drowned? Yeah, in a bathtub. Get out of here. No, what? in a waterfall. What? Yeah. I'm sorry because my brain cells were lost in a jar for all the cocaine use that I've been. Um, and, you know, and just don't, don't, don't take drugs. Say no to drugs and alcohol. All right, girls, pick a topic. Uh, do you want to talk about like men? Yeah, yeah about men. What That's happened what to your boyfriend? Your late boyfriend? Yeah, what happened to your boyfriend? Uh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. I've, I'm getting over it. He passed away in June. He drowned. <sighs> single alert. Yeah, I'm very, <laughs> very I'm single. The thing is, he was my. I tried to date in the interim. Like I tried to date in the last six months, I'm and it just so, it, so. it didn't work. No, you have to have the feeling. Work. Yeah, oh, the feeling's got to come back. You might have your hormone level checked. You know, you're depressed. Yeah. No, I. Oh, I know. I know. Okay. How long <laughs> were you with this guy? Not that long. I've only been in LA a year and a half. But you know, and he, he's friends Maybe. with my friends. There's just all these. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Oh no. Maybe it's a blessing in, dis in disguise. You know. Um, it must be hard to date after that, though. Yeah, it like is. you're comparing it to someone who's dead. Yeah, like, it's weird. It's weird. Here's what we need to do. Dr. Dick says you. I I I advise <laughs> you to not look anywhere in the past. Pretend it never happened. You know, I know it's tough. You'll always hold a place for him in your heart. Well, you know, you can have every year. You can do a party on on the anniversary of his death. And you can invite the close circle of friends and his family, and and ro and roast and toast him. Yes. Yeah. No, it's yeah. a good thing to do, and everyone's sad for a minute. But he wouldn't want you to be morose. Yeah, no, that's, I mean that's what I think about. When I when he first died, I was I have a big Twitter account and I tweet a lot, so I started writing irreverent jokes about it like right away. Like what? Uh, like how much do my dead boyfriend's ashes weigh? Enough to break the ice. Oh Hi, God. I'm oh Stephanie. Oh my God! Oh my that's God! That's not come back. That's your boyfriend's ashes. <laughs> And so I, I wrote I wrote so many jokes that I ended up doing bits and I no I, low I did class a, she didn't drown him you fool oh Go dear. On. I did oh yeah no I I got a lot of stuff like that online but yeah so I did a whole show I did a whole like 20 minutes like Jack set Titanic about in a rose. I'm on you could think of him like Titanic <laughs> like you let go or he let go I don't know I wasn't I wasn't in the water I'm where saying. were you um, I was at a comedy show and I look out outside and I got a call that he was and where what part of, was he in a lake an ocean a bathtub he was in, he was in a Punchbowl Falls in Portland. He was on vacation with a bunch of our friends. We had just gotten back from Mexico. What's that? Is it like a rapid? It's like a, it's like a cold weather waterfall type hiking. Did he go thing. over the falls? Yeah. <gasps> what happened? He must have slipped his footing. You're allowed to jump, so he jumped, and then the water was too cold, and he just couldn't. It probably froze white his men balls. Not and jump. Like, oh! white, right? He's white. He's white. White men don't jump. Yeah. White men don't jump. <laughs> Okay. What race is good at jumping? That, I don't know. Uh, it's no a, it's a movie it's starring Woody Harrelson. It's, he, he was great in that part. I love Woody Harrelson. I recently, I'm sorry, let's, uh, you know, not to just uh, slide over this topic. You know, my thoughts are with you and your Thank friends you. and your family Thank and you. his family. Sorry about that. What about you? Did you kill your ex too? No, <laughs> I didn't kill my ex. The funny thing is, well, both my parents passed away. Mm. So my dad this recently. This is not funny. Yeah, this is not funny. <laughs> but like, again, this is why I'm a comedian. Did you get all the money? 
Uh, yeah, kind of. President of the United States, the leader of the Have world. Have some decorum. Be like Maybe Reagan. So Actually, funny. Reagan did cam for the cameras. Nixon was was disaster. Kennedy was the best. And um, oh yeah, Kennedy, I would have liked. To I would have had with. sex with Kennedy. Yeah. Sure, you bet. You probably did. Are you Are you sure? No. Uh, I would have been like, like. I think I might have. Seven. <laughs> buy it and then it just spoils. They're great. The they're great. Eat it. They're great. These two should like. You know, they're great. You guys <laughs> are funny. What a relief it is. You guys are like a good in the morning. You know, it's a relief to have some women. That's that a know. good analogy. I've never yeah. been. That I mean, that. what are your feelings after you take a good dump? I want to go have sex with myself. It's just such a good feeling. You know, really? age it gets worse. Yeah. I want to take a hot shower and not touch anyone <laughs> ever again. Like, do you really? I just wanted the burrito. Like oh my God! Delivery. You guys are hilarious. <laughs> the three hottest pairs of kidding, legs in the country. <laughs> Harry Balzac is in a is is just taken like Molly, and he is sitting there shooting us compliments the whole oh, time. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, hair. Put your legs behind your le your head and yummy, low class. Yes, 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 Harry. Candace don't mind Harry. He's always desperate. They should do it again for Sister Daga. They want a scissor, Sister Daga. Okay, can you guys do you know how, about daggering on this show? No. This is Alki David's favorite thing. When oh, a daggering Lord. is show that show that clip of daggering. It's genius, where the guy gets in back of the girl and he and, and he simulates having sex and the girl daggers right back in there and it's a close up where they is that like, like really get in there. They're like, oh yeah, that looks nice. Oh, I can't do it any faster. So like, she's a nice ass. Dagger, 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 dagger. dagger. That's about as fast as my dagger will go today. It's cold outside. <laughs> Stop it. All right, sit down. Amazing. <laughs> How you like me now, mother? <laughs> this is a new cardio, I think. Oh Dagger. my God. I just think my placenta just fell out. Did it? It's yeah. It's wrong. I've had Do two you have children. You have a placenta if you're not pregnant. I think that's no, not. No, but it's a good excuse if you're late. <laughs> Oh, if you're late for a meeting or, or your, or your job, you don't understand. I was just in the four or five. You don't understand. You, understand. you got to see. You don't understand a million times, like my son. You don't understand. You don't understand, mom. You know. You know. You don't know what it's like to be your daughter. <laughs>